So, as I scroll through Facebook and Instagram, I always constantly see ads for some of these fragrance companies, the discovery sets and stuff like that. So I decided to try one out. Want to know what it is? Then <laughs> stay tuned. So the company that I initially reached out to to see if they were willing to uh, send out some samples. Um, the name of the company is called Habibi. And I reached out to the company. I said, hey, you know, I'm a reviewer, yada, yada, yada. I want to see if you got some samples, whatever, whatever. They reached back out and they said at this current moment, their discovery sets are out of stock. So I'm not going to lie. I took that as maybe this company just don't want to deal with me. So I moved on and I just kept seeing the ad on Instagram over and over and over. Habibi, this one particular fragrance, I have it here with me in this discovery set. One particular fragrance they, they have an ad for, they kept showing it over and over and over. And then I kept seeing a picture of this other fragrance, which really intrigued me. And I wanted to know about it and get my nose on it. And so what I did was as soon as I went on their website one day, it said the discovery sets were back in stock. And they, the discovery set was only what, I think 20 bucks. So I went ahead and ordered one. And it finally came in. And this is the box that it was in. It's called Habibi New York Discovery Sample Set for him. And what's neat about this is not the samples themselves, but they took the time to put all the fragrance names on the back and all the notes. And that is what makes it easy to deal with. You don't have to go online and look up note breakdowns and write all this stuff down. So if I do an actual video, I can just have this box with me and I don't have to look up notes and write down anything. Now, it's just a simple cardboard box with cutouts for the fragrances. And I already sprayed them on tissue because I just did this video and it stopped on me for some reason. But um, I already sprayed these and I actually already knew what they smelled like because I did this video maybe a week back and I just didn't upload it because it just wasn't right to me and I didn't have time to redo it. So with that being said, it also came with a carded sample, has some other fragrances from their lines unisex men and women fragrances and www.forhabibi.com is the website i will leave that in the description and it's just a thank you on the back of the card and five fragrances i have here um embrace is the first one i'm gonna do sahara rose or sahara rose however you want to pronounce it um, Revere, Woody Lavender, and Desert Oud. Now, the two fragrances that I keep seeing videos on, th and the one fragrance I see a video on is Revere. The second one I kept seeing pictures of is Desert Oud, and that is the one that intrigued me because the bottle looks fantastic, and I'm interested in Oud fragrances now. I'm not interested in that skanky animalic stuff yet, even though I do have one that I ordered not too long ago. Um, I'm just trying to get the feel of this oud and see if I can get used to it. So without further ado, let's get to it. So Embrace is the first one I'm going to do. And I'm going to pick up the pace a little bit in this video so it won't stop on me again. I think it gives me like 10 minutes. So I sprayed it on my tester strip, which is TP. And I, I do have tester strips in my truck. I just didn't run down there and get them. But this is a very nice fragrance, Embrace. I like this one a lot. This is, to me, a sexy type fragrance. You can wear this on a date. And I think it can be worn day or night. The oud that's in this one. Yes, there is oud in this. I picked it up as soon as I sprayed it when I first got it. And it's not skanky, it's not animalic, but it is there. It has some sweetness to it. And this is a very nice fragrance. And I think I'm going to pick up 
four of these fragrances. Now they are a little on the expensive side. They, they aren't cheap. So don't think that they're cheap. I am going to get them though. But Embrace is the first one. Now I've been looking for a nice rose fragrance for men. I've asked several times in the fragrance community. Sometimes I get answers. Sometimes I don't. It just depends. People have referred me to certain things, but you know, this is a nice rose fragrance. It's not overpowering. It's not one of those stringent roses that's going to turn you away. This does not smell feminine at all. It does smell masculine to me. I like this one a lot. Sahara Rose. Next is Revere. And this is the one I've seen the video on. They had this guy. He, he's getting dressed. He's fresh. He sprays the fragrance on. He goes, I guess, to work or wherever he's going. And, you know. This one smells nice also. This is a very nice smelling fragrance. I'm not going to lie. Something in this smells familiar. Yeah, something in this is familiar. I can't put my finger on it. But it's a nice fragrance, but that's the one I don't, I'm not sure. I'm going to have to take a little bit more time with that one. I'm not sold on that one yet. Um, Woody Lavender is the next one. Now, I know a lot of guys aren't into lavender. doesn't bother me. I actually use lavender in some of my shower gels. I burn lavender incense and stuff like that, so very relaxing and calming this on the other hand is nice very nice fragrance it's not an overpowering lavender it smells great it does smell like it has some kind of sweetness to it i like that one a lot that to me is very nice i think this could be relaxing too so for those of you who wear certain fragrances that you know calms you down or helps you sleep I think this would be a nice fragrance to own. And the one that I was most interested in is the last one, Desert Oud. And this is the one I kept seeing the actual picture of the bottle. And that bottle looks fantastic. It's a gold. It's like this color. It's a clear glass bottle, but it has like these type colors. It's like gold and, you know, some other colors. It looks real nice. This is a nice oud fragrance. It's not skanky. It's not like animalic. You can tell it is oud in this. Very wearable. And I am going to get that one. So I know the ones that I do want to get my hands on are the Desert Oud, the Woody Lavender, the Embrace, and the Sahara Rose. I do want those four. So... Revere, I'm going to have to take a little bit more time dealing with. Um, right now, it's just okay. But maybe if I get it on skin, we'll see. But uh, make sure you all go check out the website. Um, get you one of these gift sets. 20 bucks, you can't beat it. Um, Habibi New York Discovery Sample Set for him. www.4habibi dot com is the website i will leave that link in the description down below thank you all for tuning in here is to smelling great peace